All righty. Right, guys. Three and one. Elimination Chamber. Refuse. Refuse. That's going to be a mess. And, uh, Put 12 feds in one. One fed, three channels. You know the score. Buy one. Get, get two. two free. Yeah. My so. thumbnail's pish. <laughs> My thumbnail's a spoiler alert. But fuck it. So anyway. So, man, sort of like Big Mass John wants to kill himself. <laughs> what do you mean I lost the title after two weeks, man? <laughs> what do you mean? So anyway. Uh, Fortnite. <laughs> Elimination Chamber. Bray Wyatt won. Just fuck me. That's hey, anyway, off, really. Just <laughs> finished there. I mean, wasn't expecting much going into this pay per view. It was kind of a one match, you know, pay per view really, and it turned out to be a one match pay per view. First few matches were pretty shit. Um, and well, then the higher you went up the card, the more important the matches seemed to get. Uh, Orton, Luke Harper was pretty decent. But Orton won, which is very fucking predictable there. Um, but you couldn't make him look weak, you know what I'm saying? Naomi won for nigger month, you know, which is kind of shit-like. I mean, do you deserve to lose your Yo. belt just because you're white? No. I don't think so. So Alexa Bliss loses the title because she's white and it's African-American Appreciation Month. Don't think that's right at all, but... Black you know, lives matter. Black titles matter. Because we're all black. If you're white... And Christian and not a fucking Islamic terrorist. But anyway, the most important the match of the night, <laughs> Mojo Raleigh beat Kurt Hawkins on the pre-show. And, um, and there was some guy called, what was it? Steve Roberts? Max? Some, some fucking retarded looking bastard, man. Yeah, on he, the pre-show. He looked like a someone with Down syndrome. That was but... four hours ago, Jesus Christ. Daniel Almighty. But how long has you been rolling for? Two minutes? Alright. Oh, so man. anyway... The, we moved on to the, the, the world title match and, you know, predictable, you know, Cena and Styles going at it for four minutes. Ambrose comes in, does Five. a bunch of stupid shit. Bray Wyatt comes in, beats them up. Baron Corbin comes in, destroys thing, pe- destroys people, man. Miss, his number comes out and he stays in the, the, the pod like a shite bag. He eliminates Ambrose. Is, you know, classic Miss here. But Corbin first gets eliminated. Miz, Ambrose with a roll up. And, uh, Takes it on him. Bang, good night. Miz eliminates him. Then Miz looks strong, beating up everyone else for three minutes before. Boom! Big match, John. A-A, out nowhere. Everyone kicks out of the A at least once, unless your name's the Miz. Then the job Wyatt there. eliminates him with Sister Abigail. And then by th- this stage, you're thinking, hmm, who could possibly win the match here? Is it going to be the guy that just lost the title and has no opponent for WrestleMania? Or is it going to be Bray Wyatt, the guy that's like... Bookie's favourites and is already penciled in to face Orton for the title. And it's at this stage... You love it. That Bray Wyatt, he counters the phenomenal forearm. Good night. Sister Abigail, good yeah. night. The lights go out, everyone puts their phones up. JBL makes it as if the fucking world's changing and, you know, there's a special power here. There's mass murderers in the crowd. <laughs> it's a, it's, a bunch it's, of it's fucking, the same people that were in it for the it's past It's a bunch of fucking hours. iPhones, you know, flashing in the sky. That's what it is. It's not yeah. like a UFO invasion or something. Like and that. big Randall Keith Orton comes out. You know, he takes the hood down to look like a hard man, but he should have kept up because once he took his hood down, he bored the fuck out of me. Uh, Bray Wyatt, you know, posed on the ground with his belt. Not like in my picture where he's got it up and celebrating, he was like on the he was, ground. He was doing like a Triple H, I did my quads in, <laughs> Kevin Nash. And uh, so the show went off there, they advertised Talking Smack. I'm going to go and watch Talking Smack now. I've been Talking Smack for nearly four minutes here and I think it's time now yeah. to end this 3 and one elimination chamber. This is how cheap we are and if you don't mm-hmm. like it, piss off. Until next time. Good feds coming <laughs> Never. Next, <year. laughs> next July. Holocaust, if you hear me.